Uh, and now it's with very great pleasure that I introduce Rebecca uh, to be the next Chief Executive. I'm an incredibly proud West Australian uh, country kid uh, who grew up in the regions and I've spent a career really developing uh, the state of WA. I've got a lifelong interest in regional development and economic development, uh, which has aligned throughout my career. And, and what I see is the opportunity to partner uh, with industry and the members of the chamber to really leave industry in a stronger place than the place that I'm inheriting today. And that is an incredibly strong one, uh, one that really underpins the whole of the state's uh, economy and one that we need to continue to grow and develop and I hope that my legacy is that growth and development and that interrelationship with our regions and really bringing to life the story of just how significant industry's contribution is to community. I really live that. The Royal Flying Doctor Service can't do what it does without the partnership of industry and without the strength of a really strong mining and resources sector. So that would be my legacy. The very first thing I'm planning to do is to get to spend some time with the great team here at the CME, who I've admired uh, from a distance over many years, but most importantly to spend time uh, with all of our members. So really being able to immerse deeply in industry. Obviously I've had a chance to partner alongside industry for many years, but to, to really get to know all of our members and to then spend time together. My career has really been about uh, building the capacity of organisations. So I've worked at a state, Commonwealth and local government level, understanding the public policy interfaces between all three. And then I've spent time in the business community because to me, all of the sectors working together is how we get the best outcomes for community. So I spent my early career uh, in um, local government at a real grassroots level in that community development capacity. I then went and spent time in Canberra uh, where I worked with stakeholders and in the parliament itself. There's no better immersion in a public policy environment than working in that uh, sector. I then moved in and worked in banking uh, at a corporate social responsibility level, developing uh, industry initiatives around diversity and inclusion and social impact and investment strategies to build the growth and strength of the communities in which business operated. I've been operational in the community benefit sector for about the last eight years, uh, having started in aged care and then finishing here with the Royal Flying Doctor Service. Today, the RFDS is $122 million in turnover. It is an equal parts, an operating airline and five small hospitals. And it does that over all 2.5 million square kilometres of Western Australia. And it does that on five bases, Broome, Port Hedland, Cara um, Port Hedland, Mekathara, uh, Kalgoorlie and Jandicott. And we live and work in the regions in which we operate. And I think that's a really powerful and important narrative because what it means for us to be able to support those communities and to really understand the significance of the service that we provide. And we can't do it without the support of the community of Western Australia who have always stood by us and one that I am proudly advocating for around that sense of contribution and to be able to continue the skills that I have in stakeholder management, in communications, in government relationships, in business, um, in understanding those markets and those economies um, is really what I bring to the Chamber.